they say get back, we say fight back. Get back, fight back. Get back, fight back. The Michigan NAACP is teaming up with Black Greek organizations to bring attention to issues impacting people of color. And in light of upcoming elections and the recent overturning of Roe v. Wade, today's messages felt especially poignant. At least 100 people from the Divine Nine, the NAACP, and the Michigan legislature gathered to spend the day in Lansing talking about policy, breaking bread, and rallying for social justice. The Legislative Action Day is held by the NAACP each year, but this year they partnered up with Black Greeks to make their impact stronger. We are pleased to have our partners, the Soros and the fraternities and the, um, the sister organization, AKAs, the Deltas, the Omegas, the Kappas, you see them here in their attire. And they have a historic mission, that is to do education, to do social justice, and to get involved in the community. The Divine Nine is made up of nine historically black sororities and fraternities. The combined membership of these organizations is estimated to be about four million people. Terry Benton Ali is one of the Divine Nine Greeks who participated today. Well, politics have always been so controversial, and we're a nonpartisan organization, and we are so proud to stand since 1908 in advocation for fair voting. Some of the asks included getting lawmakers to vote down the 39 voter suppression bills in the legislature, advocating for safer schools, and participating in get out the vote efforts. Reverend Wendell Anthony spoke to the crowd, pointing out that this is a time when people should be motivated to vote out lawmakers who are looking to remove rights and overturn landmark cases like Brown versus the Board of Education. We have to cut up on the right to vote. We have to cut up those who will stop us from moving forward. We have to cut up injustice and lack of knowledge and make a sandwich and feed justice to our people. Today's event was aimed at getting the Divine Nine, lawmakers, and NAACP members to vote, educate, and fight injustice in their communities. Your Neighborhood Reporter, Erica Murphy, Fox 47 News.